Microwaves are serious business. Please don't try this at home. Once I burnt my tongue on a hot pocket. Ooh. Hello and welcome to Is It A Good Idea To Microwave This? I'm your host for this particular episode only. My name's Jonathan Paula. And this is my sidekick, Riley McElwain. Not your sidekick, Jory's sidekick. Okay, what the hell, dude? Alright? I get it. I'm the annoying camera guy, no one wants to listen to it. But alright, it's my channel, I'll do what I want. I want to host one episode. Clean that grump off your face and just smile for the camera, okay? This episode's already gone to the Come on, man. It's it smells like this guy. All hands to the deck. Nobody likes roasted nuts. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Ventilation is key. What are you doing? What? Get out! Stopping, stopping. The mask! They do nothing! The tip of shield, it actually works! Does it still work? You're dumb. 2.6. Is it a good idea to microwave this? Let's go find out. Here at Jory Karen's Microwave Laboratory, 2.6. Safety is our number three concern. And uh, uh, the reason what? that Jory isn't, you know, behind the camera is because I kind of pissed... Do you need help with that? Uh, Riley off in the intro, so Riley's on camera, Jory's over. Uh, 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 what, did uh, what did you just do? First <laughs> up. <laughs> you ready to go microwave this now? Oh, sorry, this little dangler. <laughs> oh yeah, by the way, donated by Zephora 14. And over here not donated by anybody, is Penny, our Panasonic microwave. we got some fans, we got a siren light, safety all over the place. It's great. So, we're going to put this in there. Here's the toilet, ready to flush. How long should we put it in there for, Chief? Brown goes down to... Well, it's a number. It's The thing you do in a toilet most often is a one or a two. So let's add them up and put it in there for three minutes and 33 seconds. Let's do it. That pole lights wow. up. The view is so much better from up here. Mm -hmm. And when I put these goggles on, it's like I'm wearing nothing at all. I usually don't wear anything at all when I'm on the toilet. Yeah, I don't know about you guys. When I, when I take a poop, I just like to take my pants all the way off. I do it at public urinals, let's, too, let's in the you bathroom. Just swing your feet when you're on the toilet. Just swing no, I, can, I completely undress. Socks, <laughs> shoes, everything in a public restroom. Yeah. Well, you don't want to get wet, you know? Now, now I'm not sure if you noticed this, but part of the bowl was just glowing bright red. And I have to apologize that that was mostly from the Thanksgiving dinner from last week. That was mostly... What did you eat? Razor blades? <laughs> did you just eat the whole, like, bones and all? Um, I'll be honest, there was a lot of corn. Yeah. A lot of corn. How's it going up there, Chief? Oh, it wasn't that hard. I know, right? I disagree. This job is hard half the time. I can tell from, from, your, from your pants there. I'm going to back off a bit. No. Nope. Okay. Uh oh Uh-oh. Okay, the, the water basin at the top of the toilet is now on fire. I didn't know porcelain could catch on fire. Well, apparently this plastic piece of... Oh, wow, oh wow. my goodness. Wow, it just completely degraded in seconds. Well, that's what happens usually when I'm done with it. That's a, that's a whole new type of you know, that is, right that's, there. That's diarrhea acid eating right through that. Yeah. That was a very oh, bad oh, case. Oh, it just spilled out? Oh, it had, it had bad... That's a very in. bad case of hemorrhoids. Wow, that thing is like going to town at this point. I'm Prostate gonna go, cancer. I'm going to go ahead and, and sound the red alarm here, put on our fan. And that thing, that thing is intense. We're going to need to get the gloves. This is a serious business. Ooh. It's on. All right, guys. Masks on. Ready to go. All right, Chief. Going in. And flush. Holy moly. Oh, it's not on fire. That's wow, that is, that is a mess. That, that looks like a pile that's of That happens usually when I'm done. More nasty coming in! Oh, there you go! No. Just seeing if it still works. It doesn't. No? No. You see, the problem here with this toilet is even if I did took a huge dump in this, it's all the way backed up back here. That's why I'm going to go ahead and say that microwaving a plastic toilet it's neither here nor there, neither shit nor piss, neither good idea or bad idea. I think it's just, it's just, it's a flush. It's a flush idea. I'm coming up with it right now. A flush idea? The graphic will be right here and it'll be, it'll be brown in color. Flush idea. Yeah. It's right off the spot. That's can why you, I can do that as the director. Can you smear it on there too? Yeah, just flush idea. What the f***? 
<laughs> that's how I take poos. You don't you don't do this when you poo? No. No, that's not because it helps. I think if you can't really get the velocity, it's kinda like throws it out there. So that about does it for this episode of Is It a Good Idea to Microwave This? I'm your host, Jonathan Paula. This is Jory wearing the Riley sidekick shirt. And and you'll be hosting again next week, won't you? It's a sexy idea. And also, I have Jory here as my... <laughs> <laughs> Let's, do it again. Oh, let's do it again. <laughs> you ever been in a situation, Jory, where you clog a toilet and you don't have a plunger handy? Yeah. I usually just use my fist, though. Just go in there with your fist and it's yeah. like, take yeah. that, yeah.